Hello, everyone. <laughs> everybody. So if you're watching this on the replay, just type hashtag replay in the comments. It's going to let me know you're watching this on the replay. This is my very first time trying to, um, I'm trying to stream on TikTok at the same time. <gasps> oh, I think it worked. Okay. So this is, okay. <laughs> you're watching this on the replay. This is, I, I'm using StreamYard and StreamYard currently is allowing me to stream on, um, I'm currently streaming on Facebook. Let me tell you. So everybody, I'm currently streaming on my personal Facebook page, my business Facebook page, LinkedIn, YouTube, Twitter, TikTok, and Instagram. Okay. So it, wherever you're watching this from, if you guys can comment and tell me where you're watching this from. I'm, I'm very curious. And this is really working on TikTok. Okay. If you're watching me on TikTok right now, I want you to just tell me, just say TikTok. Because I'm like, I think this is working. This is my very first time trying to um, use StreamYard to stream on TikTok. Today, I just decided I was going to try to test it. Um, and so I think it's working. I see digital traffic. I see Jamila. Okay, I think people are really here on TikTok. Okay, this is awesome. Like, this is like, this is my very first time it's happening. Okay, so I see a bunch of people on Instagram. I see TikTok. I see YouTube. What's up, YouTube? You know, we're working on our watch time hours. Okay, so this is this is awesome. Okay, so let me give you all some quick tips. So today we're talking about easy ways to create short videos. However, because you guys are like joining in on this moment where I'm like, we can now stream on TikTok, it's like monumental. I wish I had like some sound effects to go with this because I'm just like, this is awesome. Like, this is awesome. So we're, this is, this is great. Now, if you guys have questions about how it is I'm doing what I'm doing, go ahead and ask in the comments. Now, what I do have to do is I have to, um, I'm going to have to pull up like three, the, here's a downside. So you're watching this. We're talking about how I'm streaming on using StreamYard on Facebook, on YouTube, on LinkedIn, on Twitter, on Instagram, and on TikTok all the same time. The downside is like TikTok has a screen for me to see the comments and people that are joining. Instagram has a screen that shows me the comments, people that are joining, and then everybody else, right? Um, so I am needing to, so I've got StreamYard right here. Let me put Instagram, okay, over here. All right, so I'm trying to like move screens around. That way I can... Um, um, I can see everybody's questions and comments because we are going to talk about marketing and creating short videos. Um, but at this very moment, I'm just trying to move screens around so I can see everybody. Okay. So hang on one second. We are live right now on my desktop computer on TikTok, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, everywhere. Um, you, uh, LinkedIn, Twitter, everywhere right now. Okay. So one second, I'm just trying to like, what I'm doing is I'm, I'm, I'm minimizing all the screens. So I'm putting one screen here, one screen here, one screen here. So that way I can see everybody's everything. So y'all just have to give me just a second. Okay. Um, hold on one second, y'all one second. I know you guys have questions and I'm like, I'm just trying to uh, make this adjust this screen so I can see everybody. Okay. So this one, I think I need to minimize that one. Okay, so here's StreamYard with everybody. Here is Instagram with everybody. All right, um, move that over. All right, one second. Move that over. Move that over. Okay, and then now we're going to move up TikTok. Oh, this is awesome. Wow. Like, this is never... Listen, I've been a live streamer forever, right? I've been live streaming since... Periscope when it first came out. And so the fact that right now that I'm able to do all this at one time is like everything. Okay. So we're this, the whole broadcast today is going to be talking about uh, easy ways to create short videos. Okay. But I'm just telling y'all what is currently happening. Right. So what is currently happening is I'm using a tool called StreamYard. Okay. I pay for StreamYard, very minimal fee. And normally I could stream on, um, Facebook, YouTube, LinkedIn, and Twitter. But about a week ago, about a week ago, sorry, about a week ago, I learned how you could stream on Instagram too. And so I started doing, it worked. And so we are, we're live everywhere. Now, I am seeing that I'm glitching a little bit because I'm trying to like, 
you know, or whatever. Um, tell me, what is you guys experience? Those of you guys that are watching me right now, are you experiencing any kind of glitches with me talking? I can see everybody's m m messages, okay? So just, are y'all seeing any glitches? If not, just say no. If yes, just type yes, okay? Um, okay, so what am I using? So I'm currently on an iMac, my regular desktop computer, and I just use the tool StreamYard. And I'm able to be here on, literally we're on my Facebook personal page, my business page, LinkedIn, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok, which is monumental. Because currently on uh, TikTok, we have 66 people, nine people on Instagram. And then I can't see on YouTube and all that because like my screen can only take so much. Uh, but that's all going on. No glitches, no glitches. Okay. Do you have to get a streaming key for TikTok? Yes, you have to get a... Okay. So let me tell you how I'm doing what I'm doing here. So on StreamYard, when you set up a when you set up a stream or whatever, if you have like it's called destinations. If you have your Facebook, LinkedIn, and all that stuff set up, then you could just easily click, 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 click. For Instagram, you have to go on Instagram desktop, and you have to hit um, create on the left hand side of the screen, and then you'll see where it says live. Right. Once you hit live, then it gives you the RTMP what something something whatever. Um, and then it asks you for the server URL and the stream key. Same thing goes for TikTok. So then you go on TikTok desktop, you hit go live, you set it up, and then it asks you, then uh, you're able to hit go live on TikTok. Once you hit go live on TikTok, you take the URL and post it to StreamYard, and you take the stream key and post it to StreamYard, and then this is how we are live everywhere. So if you're just joining we are currently live on one device, not no longer having to have all of my phone set up. And we're live on my Facebook personal page, Facebook business page, LinkedIn, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. Okay. All right. But I got, I got so sidetracked because I was so shocked that it worked. Okay. So I, anytime I go live, I always like to, um, I always like to share it to my Facebook groups. Um, and so if y'all give just give me just one second, I'm going to share this to my Facebook group. I have a free Facebook group, which is called TikTok Marketing with Kia Kelly. And it doesn't just allow me to just share it in there automatically. Um, and so I wanted to hit share in there. OK, so one second. And then I'm trying to post this into my story, my Facebook story, but it's not letting me. That's OK. All right. OK, so let's see. <laughs> I'll see all, everybody's like, what? Yes, StreamYard is an app. Yes, for sure. Um, let me see. Questions, comments. I'm going to try that today. Awesome. When you post it, it will be clear with their new features. Can you carry it buffered a little bit? Okay. Thank you, my boss, Mayo. Uh, eight platforms at one time. I know, right? It's awesome. All right. So today we're talking about, you know, easy ways to create uh, short videos. Okay. Easy way. <gasps> oh, also, sorry, I just saw this. Um, also, like when you're on TikTok, on your phone, I can't write in the comments, but I can, I'm gonna test this right in the comments. Okay, so I can see where I can write in the comments. So I'm also curious uh, because TikTok for the longest time would not let you post links. <gasps> okay, TikTok desktop just allowed me to post a link. Uh, now I doubt that the link is clickable, Right. So those of you guys that are watching this on TikTok, where it's, I, I posted a, a link to a page, I, tell me if that's clickable for y'all or not. I, I don't think it is. Um, I don't think it's clickable for anybody except for those people that are on like Facebook and YouTube and all that. I'm pretty sure y'all can click it, um, but I'm pretty sure on like Instagram, y'all can't click. Let me just let me try really quickly. So for those of y'all, tell me if y'all can click. Let's see. Let's see. I don't see a link. No, it's not. No, it's not. I know it's not. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Uh, error. Try again. Okay. All right. <laughs> okay. So this is, this is still awesome. Okay. So again, let's have a conversation about creating short videos. All right. Now I want you guys to first tell me what are some of the struggles that you have with creating short videos? Whether that is short videos on, uh, okay, thanks on Instagram. Whether that is short videos on TikTok or short videos on Facebook or um, Instagram or YouTube shorts. What are some of the struggles that all you guys are having with creating short videos? Okay, I can see everybody's comments, which is awesome. I can see it all on one screen. So like, woo. 
okay? So this way I can like see all the things at one time, okay? Now, um, I will tell you guys this. I remember when short videos started becoming a thing from marketing um, in 2020. And for me, it was the link is there, but not clickable. Okay, thank you. Um, and so for me, the struggle was I was so used to being a live streamer. Like I got my start on Periscope, which was live stream. You were there for like an hour and then some, you know? And so to think that I would be able to like, um, to think I would be able to, you know what? I got a quick question for y'all. Those of you all that are watching this on TikTok, what does it look like? Okay, I'm gonna see. Let me on my on my mobile phone on my um, other accounts because uh, this is my first time streaming. Um, this is my first time. Um, hold on, um, I'm looking at my personal page. Okay, where's Kia Kelly? Okay, um, this is my first time streaming from a desktop, so I'm wondering if it if it gives you guys a bad experience. I'm wondering about that. Let me uh, see. Okay, okay. No, uh, it looks really good. I'm so amazed. Okay. Okay. <gasps> Let me see. Oh my god. Oh, this is awesome. Like, oh, wait a minute. I'm having a whole moment with y'all live. Look, y'all. Look. Wait, wait, wait a minute. I cannot even believe this is happening. It's like Christmas. Hold on, y'all. Everybody that is on TikTok. You are watching me in vertical mode. I want you guys to click like in the lower, what size is this? Lower right hand side, there's like a uh, like a vertical and a horizontal. If you click on that, it's gonna turn me um, horizontal. Y'all see that? It's gonna turn me horizontal. Like this is crazy. I'm like, <laughs> I need to like, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Listen, y'all don't understand. This is monumental. And so I want to do a video on this. Like, listen, this is about to change the game again. When I tell y'all that TikTok is constantly changing the game, constantly. Hold on, hold on. I got to pull this up myself. Y'all know I do TikTok tutorials. And so I got to be able to showcase that this, that this is happening right now. Hold on, hold on. Click on that. All right, I have to do a screen recording of this. Y'all probably like, why is she so excited? Because all these new features are insane, okay? It's all right. So, all right, we have, listen, in order for me to be able to do a good tutorial, I have to have this joker pulled up, okay? So I got that, and then we're going to click on that there. And then here we are there. Okay, so then once I do that, then it says auto. I'm going to click on auto to see what does that do. So this could be whatever your automatic like uh, uh, setting is, or you can do 720, seven, like the picture quality, 720, 540, or 360. That's awesome. This, this just makes me so happy. Um, and then I can hit share where I can share with people. Background player, what does that mean? <laughs> I can't. I can't, I cannot. This is amazing. Like y'all, if you guys are not going live on TikTok, TikTok just changed the game. TikTok just changed the game. If you go live on TikTok on desktop and you're horizontal, people can now not only watch you vertically, but they can turn their phones and you will be horizontal. L listen, if you guys have not been seriously creating content on a regular basis on TikTok, it is time. This is, it's time. Like, this is insane. Like, listen, uh, listen, we are at the brand new beginning of 2023, brand new year. This is the year where you decide that you're going to take it seriously. I am sitting here in awe that first of all, that I'm streaming on uh, live on Instagram, live on TikTok, Facebook, it's uh, LinkedIn, YouTube, Twitter, all from StreamYard. First of all, I'm freaking out that that is happening. Second of all, that my video turned horizontal. This is like a whole thing. Like how many of you guys are excited by that? If, if that excites any of you all, 
then just type me in the comments because y'all can see my excitement. We have a whole conversation we're supposed to be talking about here today, and I'm hyped with that, okay? And so listen, again, the tool that I'm using to do all of this is StreamYard. StreamYard, okay? Everybody on TikTok is like, yes, we're excited, okay? So if you guys are excited on TikTok, do me a favor and just tap your screen and give likes because tapping your screen causes engagement. TikTok loves the engagement. And then you guys, y'all can say whatever you want to say in the comments everywhere else. I would love that, okay? So StreamYard, I don't know how much StreamYard is. It's very, very inexpensive. It's it's so inexpensive. Things like $10, $15, $20, something like that. It's very, very, very low, okay? All right, let me hang up on this stream because it's like, it's talking to me and I'm getting distracted. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so listen, I do want to talk about TikTok because this is why I'm so excited. But specifically, we, the live stream today was set to talk about easy ways to create short videos, okay? But since I'm so excited about TikTok, I want to answer some questions you have about TikTok while I'm talking about easy ways to create short videos, okay? So, so many people find themselves like, I don't know what to do as it pertains to creating short videos, right? But listen, it does not have to be hard, right? The thing is, is that this is just gonna require a lot of practice. That's it. It's just gonna require a lot of practice and then confident by, confidence behind the camera. Even if you choose not to go live, you can still create short videos. I wanna record one for y'all right now. So hold on, let me stop recording that. My screen is still recording. Okay, so listen, I was just talking to you guys all about TikTok's newest way where I can stream on StreamYard and you can turn your phone horizontal. I want to record a quick video right now of just wh what you can do, right? First of all, once you have whatever your topic is, all you're going to do is you can either have your phone set up on a tripod. I have a ring light right there. I have a tripod over there, right? You Or you can hold your phone. Right. It just depends on what you want to do. I talk with my hands. So typically when I'm recording videos, typically I have my phone set up in a tripod because I'm like I'm very animated, as you guys can see. OK, <laughs> just as y'all can see. All right. So here is how you do it. Right. Listen, let me pause and get my thoughts together and then I'm going to going to just do a quick video. Now, this is not going to be perfect because I'm doing this on the fly, like just on the spot. But that's why I said, give me a second to think, and then I'll say it, okay? So just one second, and I'll think, okay, hold on. <laughs> like, I got a whole audience. Everybody's watching. My mom is here. No, she's not here, but she could be. All right, here we go. Okay. <laughs> it's like, all these people are watching. Okay. <laughs> hold on. I just felt like Jim Carrey. Let me think of nothing. That's how I just felt, but I, <laughs> that's not what I said, but that's kind of how I felt. Anyway, let me see myself on screen say that. Hold on, let me see. Hold on, I want to see if I don't do that on screen. Let me see. <laughs> Just saw the recording. Okay, okay, sorry. All right, okay. Okay, here we go. If you're not creating content on TikTok, you should be. TikTok just changed the game. Not only can you go live on TikTok, but you can now use StreamYard to be able to go live on TikTok. But not only that, most people, when we go live, our videos are horizontal. Everything has changed. So now, once you go live on TikTok, people can either watch you vertically or they can click on the button and their videos will turn in horizontal mode. Listen, TikTok is changing the game over and over and over again. And if you're not adding TikTok to your marketing mix this year, you should be. Y'all see how easy that was? I was just like talking about exactly what I was just telling y'all and I just shot it. That video was 26 seconds. I Listen, I will probably use that because it was like, it was just, it was there, right? But it's just that easy, right? But here's, here's something else. Something else to note that if you don't find it that easy to do it, here's what you can do. You literally can have paper, okay? And you can write down the, the topic. You can shoot and stop. You can shoot and stop. You can shoot and stop right? And just look at your bullet points, right? And then you take the recording and then you just chop it up. Like you just chop it up in your phone. We all know how to go in our phone and like, you know, make a bit. We all know how to do that in our phone. And you could easily do that together. And that way you get your next point, say it in your phone and stop. 
get your next phone or a point, shoot in your video and stop. It doesn't have to be so easy and it doesn't have to be so um, like, it doesn't have to be a big production to create short videos. Now, listen, we have all seen those short videos that look super good, super high quality and all that, which is awesome. I can't do that. I can hire somebody to do that, but that is not something that comes natural to me. How many of y'all want to produce a lot of short videos that are hot? Like you had to hire somebody to help you with that. How many of you guys want to do that? I, I don't want to do that. I want things to be easy. I want the things to be cost effective. And if things can be cost effective without me having to get a whole staff of people, then let's go. That's why influencer marketing works so well because businesses, uh, they can pay people like me so they give me a script or what have you. And then I can shoot it in my office or whatever, edit it, and then give it to them, right? Because we know how to record short videos, all right? Wait, someone said they can't hear me. Peggy, you can't hear me? Can everybody else still hear me? Everybody that's watching, can everybody else still hear me? Can everybody else? See? Okay, Warrior and Action can hear me. Um, Jamila can hear me. Okay, everybody else. So Peggy, you probably want to go out and come back in, and maybe that'll work for you, okay? Thank you guys so much, okay? Now, I, listen, I, I want to pause, and I want to answer a question, because I don't want you guys just watching me, because y'all just watched the whole thing about me with like this, the live stream and stream yard and then like the, the short video that was like a lot all in like five minutes and so I want to pause and I want to answer questions okay y'all can hear me okay thank you guys so much let's pause and let's answer let's answer some questions so those of you guys that are here on TikTok if you would do me a favor just keep tapping your screen and giving likes if you're not following me yet on TikTok please feel free uh, to follow me you know I'm always giving business and marketing tips and helping you to make money online uh, and then, shameless plug, you know, we are trying to get the watch time hours up on our YouTube channel. And so if you're here and you're live and you plan on continuing to watch me live in the next 15 or 20 minutes, if you wouldn't mind, come to YouTube. We're live on YouTube and it's under King and Kelly. And if you watch me live on YouTube versus where you're watching me now, it counts towards our watch time hours. So it would be awesome. If you could leave wherever you are and come to our YouTube channel at Kia Kelly, and we are still live on YouTube, we can answer questions and all that. I would really, really, really appreciate that. Okay, that way we can get our watch time hours up because once you get watch time hours, four thousand hours, that's how you get monetized on YouTube. And we are so far away from those hours, but y'all being there will, will definitely help. Okay, all right. So let's uh, let's answer some questions. So Streamyard, I don't see it in my app. So Streamyard is a desktop feature. So you can go to Streamyard.com. Um, uh, Rachel, go to Streamyard.com. Okay. So Peggy, if you can't hear me, come on YouTube. Just go to YouTube.com/slash Kia Kelly, and you can hear me there. Okay. But make sure you turn up your your volume, just just in case your volume's off. Just in case. All right. Let's answer some questions. Uh, so Streamyard. Okay. Hey girl, long time no see. With an HSM Fitness. Who's that? Tell me your name. Let's answer some questions. Want to add the writing that pops up as you talk and highlight. So listen, I could do that on StreamYard, but it's like it's hard to see everybody's everything, right? So if people ask questions on TikTok, I can't pull them up on screen like that on StreamYard because it's the RTMP or whatever, whatever. I can pull that up for people on Facebook, LinkedIn, um, and um, uh, Facebook, but I can't pull them up for Instagram and I can't pull them up for TikTok because they're just not, they're not connecting like that right now. Go into YouTube. Thank you. Okay. Let's answer. So what business questions, TikTok questions, streaming questions, what questions do you guys have? What is this? No title. So this is supposed to say easy ways to create short videos. That's what it's supposed to say, <laughs> but um, because we're live on TikTok from my desktop, maybe it didn't show up that way, okay? But hey, Iris. Okay, let's see. I don't see how to get the info for TikTok. When I press live, it just goes live. Okay, so if you're on desktop, then you have to also, you have to also put your stream key and your URL in StreamYard under the um, RTMP settings or whatever it's called. Um, my niche on TikTok is food, so it's hard to make a whole bunch of videos quickly since I have to be out and about getting footage. Any suggestions? Okay, so someone here is her niche or their niche is food. So I want everybody in the comments, give 
them some recommendations on short pieces of content they can they can record around food and i'm gonna read them that way i because listen i can give you uh, ideas all day long but i also want you guys to be involved in this so that way you guys are like oh this is so good you and then it makes you want to ask questions and get help as well okay um so okay recipes that's good um we want more more so we got recipes you can also film yourself going to the grocery store. You could be out and about saying, okay, today um, today I'm going to go to the grocery store. We're going to make spaghetti, and we need to go and get this, 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 and this. Come shopping with me, right? That's the first part of the video. Second part of the video is you picking up tomatoes saying, this is why I like these tomatoes, not these tomatoes. Then you're showing these onions, and then, like, now you got all your groceries, and you're showing the, the – I'm still recording like this. Um, you can show people the all the things you would bring in for, for cooking, right? And so then you can show how you wash your veggies, right? Or what you, you see what I mean? These little small things, okay? Um, let me see. We have uh, comfort food, shopping trip, quick meals under 30 minutes, eating healthy, five best slices to choose, video of ingredients, then the finished product. What specifically about food? Sorry, it's restaurant recommendations. Okay, so you you give people you do, you do videos giving people re restaurant recommendations. Okay, so they need tips for if they're giving people re um, restaurant recommendations. Okay, all right. Now, as everybody's chiming in on that, I want more questions. What questions do you guys have about creating short videos or TikTok marketing? Right. Listen, if you are in business, this is not a time for you to be saying, "Oh, TikTok ain't my audience ain't there." <laughs> okay. Okay. Listen, <laughs> that's me like, no. Okay. Right now on TikTok, we have 447 people in the room. How many of you guys are over 30? You are 30 and older. If you are 30 and older, put your age in the comments. I'm going to read that age out loud. So everybody watching on all these places can see the ages of everybody here in the room. Okay. 36, 41, yes, 34. There's 459 people in here on TikTok right now. Um, 43, 52, 52, okay? 55, 44, uh, 52, 44, 30, 50, 30, 42. Do y'all hear what I'm 46, 60, 46, 30, 42. Do y'all see what I'm saying? How many people here in the room are over 30? Oh, listen, if you don't want to tell your age, just type me. Some of y'all are like, I don't want to tell nobody my age. <laughs> so if you're here in the room on TikTok and you're over 30, just type me. Thank you so much for the gift. Listen, your audience is there. Hey, Stacy. okay? Me, 42, right? 61, me. Your audience is here. The problem is you're not right? The problem is not TikTok. The problem is you. And I don't mean that negatively. I mean that you're not posting content on TikTok. Your audience is there scrolling and watching. Every Listen, how many y'all that don't post content on a regular basis watch TikTok content? If you watch TikTok content and don't post on a regular basis, type a one in the comments. If you watch TikTok content on a regular basis and you don't post on a regular basis, type one. I'm telling you, it's the, it, the chats are going to explode because most people are watching, are scrolling and not posting, right? Most people. And I get it. It's probably because you don't either know how to post or you don't think that your audience is there to watch the content but I guarantee you they're there watching, scrolling, laughing, engaging, and all the things, right? That's like people, it's like they, they got Keith on TikTok who is blown up like crazy, who is an awesome human being, who does a lot of food reviews. And we all know what happened with Frankerson's. Like well, most of us on TikTok have watching Keith. We all know what's happened with that. And that, um, I was just watching a video of Frankerson's, the restaurant, and they just did a video and posted earlier today from yesterday, that line was out the door all day. They kept filming the restaurant and outside, and you would see totally different people inside and outside all day into the night. 
And those people were not 20 years old. They were not. They were at least early to, or later 20s and up. What, now, now you will say, well, what does that mean anything? Because they're the ones watching Keith's videos and they're the ones took action and went and stood outside the uh, Frankerson's restaurant for how, who knows how long to get the lemon pepper wings. Like how many y'all on TikTok or that you know who I'm talking about with Keith, how many y'all want them lemon pepper wings? I want the wings. I live in San Diego. We're not that far away. I'm like, well, we might have to make a trip because first of all, that's good content. Second of all, I love a good wing, right? You know what I'm saying? Like, how many of y'all want to go to Vegas? Anybody here say, I want to go to Vegas. I want them wings. You know what I'm saying? Your audience is there. You're just not there. And if you would be there, and if you would take it seriously, I'm not saying abandon your marketing strategy. That's not what I'm saying. I'm saying that here is your strategy, and then you need to add TikTok to your strategy. Because I'm telling you, they have changed the game. Just from here alone, hey, San Diego, from today alone, when I showed y'all that I could go live on TikTok from my desktop from StreamYard, and then how you could change vertical to horizontal, I'm over here like, is Jesus, is the rapture here? Is Jesus coming for me? Because this just made my, this just made my life so much easier. Y'all don't even understand. I literally just bought a tripod. Like, listen, I have my regular link ring light, but I just brought this tripod into my office today because I, I'm always streaming from my phone too. I'm like, I don't even need this. I'm gonna keep it though, cause I pay for it, you know what I mean? I'm able to do one stream, one stream. And there's, listen, there's 538 people in here from TikTok. <laughs> listen, if you guys are not currently following me on TikTok, please hit the follow button, that way you can stay connected, okay? And then like, I don't know how many folks are on Facebook. Let me see real quick, let me see. There's 15 from Facebook and YouTube, 10 on Instagram, and 546 on TikTok. Listen, is there anybody in the room that you're currently watching me and you don't currently follow me? If there's anybody in the room who you came in and you're not a, my current follower, but you will follow probably after this broadcast, if that's you, just type me in the comments. Because it's really important to know that like, if you're using live stream on TikTok, it doesn't just notify the people that follow you, but your live stream goes on the For You feed. It also goes into the TikTok Live Center. And so people can log in and they can see you and say, ooh, I want to watch this stream. And then guess what? They can follow you if you choose. Like, it shows me right now there's 557 people in the room from TikTok. Five people just followed me. And we already have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight people who said, hey, they don't currently follow me. And then they just followed me. Somebody else, I just see Amal G11 just followed me on TikTok because I'm live here. And I was going to be live anyway, teaching everywhere else. And now we're here on TikTok too. Okay. What questions do you guys have about TikTok? What questions? Thanks for following Jess K. Just thanks for following Naya. Uh, not, wait, Naya Ebony. Ebony? I can get your name wrong. I'm so sorry. <laughs> what questions do you guys got? Anybody have any questions? Now, I will tell you guys this. I am teaching a class. Now, listen, hold on. Let me just real quick. I'm going to get this out of the way. The class is $10. But let me, let me, before I say this, I need y'all to just listen. Before you hang up, the class is $10. The class is one hour. I usually charge $2,500 for an hour. So just listen before y'all go, there's the catch. There's the catch. She's always charging for something. Uh, hang it up. Before you do that, just listen. I normally charge $2,500 teaching people how to make money. Listen, and the reason is because I've been in the game for 20 years, 20. So there's so much that I know. I've paid so many coaches and consultants so much money. So they have taught me so much, okay? That's my disclaimer. Okay, we got that out of the way. So I'm teaching a class, okay? It's one hour and it's $10. That's less than going to get the chicken sandwich meal at Chick-fil-A. I just went a couple weeks ago. It's less than going to Chick-fil-A and hearing my pleasure, okay? <laughs> I'm just saying. All right, this class is an hour and I'm teaching you how to get your business ready before you go viral. How to get your business ready before you go viral. Let me tell you some stuff. 
I have had so many people send me so many messages and they're just distraught because they're going viral and their business isn't ready. They don't, they can't capture leads. They can't sell their products because their stuff isn't ready. I watched a lady in 2020, she went viral, 70 million views. Write this in the comments. She got 70 million views on this video. No link in bio. She couldn't capture any leads. She couldn't make any sales. Let me explain what I mean by capturing leads. Okay, let's just say you sell water bottles and you go viral on TikTok. Congratulations, that's awesome. And let's just say you sell 10,000 water bottles. You're very excited. But what if 1 million people, let's just say 100,000, let's just say 100,000 people went to your website. Yes, you sold 10,000. That's a great day. Would you rather have 10,000 sales or 100,000 people that have opted in as leads? Y'all tell me in the comments, would you rather have the 10,000 sales or the 100,000 leads? Okay, because leads are people that said, hey, I want more information or whatever, or people that the 10,000 people that actually bought. Which one would you guys prefer? Yes, she got 70 million views on that one video, okay? Leads, okay, I see opt-ins, leads, leads, 100,000 leads, leads, leads. Okay, leads for me too, and here is why. Because 10,000 is great for a sale, right? But if you get 100, excuse me, if you get 100,000 people to be able to opt-in, now you have their information. Now you can contact them. You can let them know you got this now in pink, you got this in blue, you got this in brown. But if you can't capture those 100,000 leads, what's the point? You know, I'm not about just making sales. And I teach my audience that we don't just focus on making you go viral. We don't just focus on helping you make $100,000. Because mm -mm. we want you to make 100,000 again and again and again. We don't believe in one hit wonders. OK, we do not believe in one hit wonders. And if you don't know how to prepare your business before you go viral, then you can't the repeat. It can't happen. You know, it just can't happen. Right. That's like one of the things that I wish that Frankerson's had. The company that Keith has highlighted is I wish that they had some type of email capture. Right. Because it's awesome that these people are coming to his store. That is awesome. But what if he got every single person that inquired on his email list and he was able to send out emails talking about Vegas? Listen, oh my God, I got to listen, I ain't talking to Keith or somebody. Listen to me. What if he was able to get all these people on his email list? Because like there's 70 million views on that video. What, how many, how many is on that now? It's a lot. Let's just say it's 40 million, just in case. And a lot of them don't live in Vegas. But what if Frankerson's had a capture on his on his website and captured everybody? And then like once a week, once a month, they sent out a newsletter talking about we got this new sauce. Oh, he talked about our fries. Now we got garlic butter fries. Now we got what if he was able to talk about all that? And when people uh, are trying to plan, plan their trip, they're like, I'm going to Vegas. I'm going to Vegas. They just they just start planning. I'm going to Vegas. I'm going to Vegas. Right. He will get all the business. Does that make sense? Like it's a whole thing, right? And so when I'm teaching this class, I'm teaching you how to do all of that, right? Listen, I spent a lot of my career learning this. I spent a lot of money learning this. And I'm teaching this, guys, for $10. $10, okay? Now listen, TikTok, you, okay, hold on. If you're interested in this class, it's $10. It's going to be on Tuesday of next week. I just said, who knew? I know, girl. I know. It's going to be on Tuesday of next week at 4 o'clock Pacific, which is 7 o'clock Eastern. I can't translate all the other time zones because I don't know them. <laughs> okay, I know. That's 4 o'clock Pacific because I'm in San Diego. And then 7 o'clock Eastern because I used to live on the East Coast. Okay. Now, if you are on Facebook or you're on Instagram, you can just type the word viral. 
if you're on Facebook or Instagram, you can type the word viral and then our system will send you a link automatically. TikTok, it doesn't work for you because TikTok doesn't have automation tools like that. So we have an automation tool called ManyChat to where Instagram and Facebook can type the word viral and it will send them a link. Everybody else, if you are on YouTube, LinkedIn, Twitter, um, or TikTok, here's the link. The link is kenyakelly.com slash viral. Okay. Um, kenyakelly.com slash viral. Everybody write that down. There's also a link in my bio. Okay. Listen, this, we're not doing this class again. So y'all like, I, are you going to do it on replay? No, no. It is one time on this coming Tuesday. What's today? Tuesday? Next Tuesday. Okay. I'm going to clarify. Tuesday. Hold on. Let me, let me look at the date to be sure. Oh yeah. Today's Wednesday. So Tuesday, uh, January 17th. Okay. It is going to be $10, four o'clock Pacific, seven o'clock Eastern. Okay, you can either go to kenyakelly.com slash viral, or you can click the link on my profile here on TikTok. Okay, uh, listen, this is going to bless you so much. I wish I could teach this to fragrances. I wish I could teach this to every single person who constantly goes viral on the platform because it is so important. It is, listen, it is, listen. Okay, let me tell y'all another story. As a business, we understand the importance of having leads, right? So what we have done all this year is we have put tracking on everything, right? If you click on a link on my podcast, if you click a link on my YouTube, if you click a link in my email, wherever you are clicking, it's tracking. It's not tracking you. It's tracking where your source is coming from. Let me explain. If you go to, let's just say, you decide to sign up for this class. If you sign up for this class using the link on TikTok and you make the purchase, it's going to tell us this person purchased because of the TikTok link. It's not going to track you. It's just tracking where the sale is coming from, okay? And so we started tracking this all last year. And I have a course. It's not available right now. And it's called Monetize the Top, and it's a mastermind. And we tracked it. Okay, and in May of last year, we brought in right around a hundred thousand dollars. Okay, and when we tracked, where did most of the money come from? I want y'all to tell me where y'all think the money came from. Everybody vote. If you have fingers that work, I, listen. I've been teaching y'all for the last forty minutes. I want every single person here to talk back to me. <laughs> y'all like what? Everybody talk back to me. Okay. And my lips are starting to get dry. Hold on. <laughs> I've been talking a lot. My lips are dry. So everybody tell me, where do you think that majority of the sales came from? Okay, hold on. I'm looking for some lip gloss. Oh crap. I almost forgot to take my vitamins. Got this big old bag of vitamins. Okay, hold on. I'm looking for some lip gloss, but I just keep talking. Hold on. Wait, wait, y'all. Okay, there you go. All right. So where do you, okay. Uh, TikTok, 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 TikTok. Okay. Um, let's see. TikTok, Instagram, TikTok, TikTok, email list, TikTok, TikTok. Okay. 10 more people. There, there's a, listen, there's a whole lot of y'all in this room. TikTok, there's like 800 of y'all in here. I need y'all to vote. <laughs> y'all just watching. Like, we just watching. I need you to participate. <laughs> Okay. All right. Okay. Everybody vote. Where do y'all think it came from? We got 10 more people. TikTok. TikTok. Email. Come on. Five more people. Let's see. Email. Email. TikTok. One more person. <laughs> TikTok. Okay. Listen. We brought in about $100,000. 85000 of those came from our email list 85,000 of those dollars came in from our email list not TikTok not Instagram not YouTube not our podcast our email list you probably like how in the world here's here's why 
Because when people join the email list, we start talking to them. We're serving them. We're teaching. We're answering. We're, we brought them into our community. And we've made them an offer. And sometimes they say, ah, oh, I'm not ready. That's okay. They're still on our email list. And we continue to talk to them and teach them and serve them. And then we make them an offer. And sometimes they say, yes, I'm ready. And sometimes they say, mm, I'm not ready. Right? But, but we at least can talk to them. Right? If on TikTok, like there's 868 people here in the room. I can post a video, but all 800 of y'all don't get a notification to come and watch this video. But if all 800 of you guys are on our email list and we send you an email, everybody's going to get a notification. Right? So if you're able to pull your, your community from social media to your email list, you have complete control. Does this make sense? That's like, just think about it. What if you had 100,000 subscribers on whatever social media platform and you got them all off of that platform onto your email list? You send one email, 100,000 people get a notification, right? So I have this Apple Watch, right? And on this Apple Watch, the thing's just talking to me, right? So it just told me, my Apple Watch just said, Chris, so, okay, I'm gonna get your name wrong. Chris Soapy Jew, Chris Soapy Jew just purchased the webinar. This is what my Apple Watch just told me, right? Which is awesome, right? Now, guess what? Like, we, we also will be able to serve Chris. Right, because now Chris has joined our email community, so now she's gonna get lots of teaching from us, like on a on a regular basis. I'm always teaching and serving, and I'm saying, "How can I help you? What do you need help with?" And if Chris emails us back and asks a question, and guess what, we gonna respond to her, right? You y'all see what I'm saying? And so, like, guess what? At some point in time, Chris gonna be opening her email, or he is, because we're teaching and serving and giving value. Does that make sense? So 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 important for you to learn how to do this. I don't care if you sell products, if you sell services, I don't care if you are a minister or if you are an influencer. At some point in time in your influencer marketing career, you're gonna wanna get paid from brands and sell your own stuff. Listen, what if, what if you are an influencer and you've got a million followers, wherever, right? And you say, you know, right now you may not be thinking about it, but what if you're able to get a million followers onto your email list and you decide I'm going to launch a line of merchandise. Great. You can post it on social media, but what if all 1 million of them are on your email list? You're going to sell out so fast because all 1 million people will get a notification when you send that email. What if you decide to start teaching influencers how to make money in influencer marketing and you start selling consulting or courses? You're going to make money so fast because now you've captured them as a lead. Does this all make sense? So I'm like, I am so passionate about this because I understand this as a business that a lot of people don't really think about the fact that outside of that outside of um, their social media platform, that email is the most important thing that they could do, right? It's the most important thing, but most people don't do it because one, they don't see the value no one has taught them, or two, they don't know how to do it. And today, I'm telling you how to do it, and I'm also telling you to come on to the webinar. The webinar is $10, and I am teaching you how to do it. I'm going to teach you about abandoned cart emails, about your opt-ins, your upsells, the downsells. I'm going to listen. I'm going to teach y'all about all that. Listen, have you ever gone to a website? And you went there to go buy, I just happen to have this on my desk, I'm going to show it to you. You went there to go and buy candy canes. That's all you came for. You was like, I need some candy canes for my Christmas tree. That's all you came there for, right? You came there for that, okay? And but so you go to check out. And then they say, hey, in addition to these candy canes, we actually have balls or lights or whatever. And you're like, oh. I want that too. So then you add that to your cart. And then they say, oh, we've got this too. And you're like, oh. So then you end up adding that to your cart too, right? That's not by happenstance. <laughs> Listen, that is not by happenstance, right? Or have you ever went to go buy candy canes and then they, they offer you this thing? And you say, no, I don't want that. And then they say, well, 
we will give you 25% off. And you're like, all right. Because you said no to it, they say, okay, we'll give it to you at a discount because they really want you to buy an add-on. Has, has that ever happened to any of y'all? It happens to me all the time. And I, and I and I like a sucker, I buy it. You know, that happens to me on Amazon. That happens to me on Sheen. That pretty much happens to me at Target. <laughs> I go to Target to go get Too Faced and they got like onesies up front. And I'm like, I'm a onesie kind of girl. Or they got Slim Jims. I love Slim Jims. Like, I love Slim Jims. Or I go to get one Kiwi Strawberry Snapple and they got a six pack and I'm like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Or you go to Trader Joe's to go and get whatever you went to Trader Joe's to go and get and then something else. And you're just sitting there like, you could say no, but it's like, it, it, it got gotcha. you. But you that you got yourself, okay? So Annette said, I signed up and cannot wait. Yay, Annette. Welcome. So glad to have you. <laughs> Hook, line, and sinker. You know what I'm saying? It's like, they get you. You know, like, it's all of us, Right? I did that today as a consumer. Tacked on a different product for $97. Christina said she tacked on a product for $97. What if that was you? What if you knew how to do the same thing? Listen, I am selling y'all hard. And this webinar is only $10. $10, listen, listen. Hold on. Somebody else just joined. Let me see. Who's that? Uh, BB and BB by B and B by Marcy. BNB by Marcy, welcome to the webinar. <laughs> I just got a notification. I love my Apple Watch. I don't have a lot of notifications on my watch, but I do have a notification about PayPal. <laughs> so welcome to the webinar. Okay. What if y'all had that stuff? That is what I'm talking about. When y'all hear some of these people make this much and this amount of money, this amount of money, you like, how are they doing that? They have these things, these automation things set up. And if you don't know how to do them, then you know what I'm saying? Okay. So again, if you guys want to join it, listen, it's $10. It's not a lot of money. It's $10. Some of y'all just spent $10 earlier today, right? You just want to go to kingandkelly.com slash viral. kingandkelly.com slash viral, or there's a link in my bio, okay? Now, let's do some more questions. When is the webinar? Good question. The webinar is on Tuesday, next Tuesday, at 4 p.m. Pacific, which is 7 o'clock Eastern. So 4 p.m. Pacific, 7 o'clock Eastern. I'm going to be live on Zoom. You'll be on Zoom with me, but I'll be teaching. Um, more questions. Are you talking about ClickFunnels? So ClickFunnels is a tool you can use to sell that way. But you can sell using all types of software. But you don't have, it doesn't have to be ClickFunnels. That's just, that's just one of the tools, okay? We use uh, ThriveCart for, uh, for our set. When we're doing things like that, we use ThriveCart. Okay, but ClickFunnels is awesome. Russell Brunson is the man, like hands down. Uh, let me see. Something else just happened. Uh, Rachel Thompson, welcome to the webinar. <laughs> Rachel Thompson, so glad to have you uh, at the webinar. It's gonna be, listen, it's gonna be awesome. I'm like, I'm telling y'all, like, it's 10 bucks, but <laughs> it's like, it's $10. Like, it's $10 to learn all this stuff. Y'all gonna be like, I am so glad that I was able to, like, instead of going to Chick fil A today, uh, I can do this webinar. Okay. Cat's Life, thanks for following. I love that name, Cat's Life. You know, I have three cats. I am obsessed. I'm up so obsessed with my cats that my cats are on my Apple Watch. That's my little, listen, I got a whole, let me show y'all real quick. I'm like one of those people. Let me see if I can show y'all my cats. Let me see. But listen, what questions? You have questions about the webinar? Oh, I'm glad you asked. So for the, hold on, let me see. We have the keys to the office. <laughs> the keys to the office LLC. Welcome to the webinar. Okay, so to sign up for the webinar, you go to kingyakelly.com slash viral. Kingyakelly.com slash viral or click the link on my profile. Okay. Christina just signed up. Yay, girl. Glad you hit with us. Okay, let me show you all my cats. Okay, real quick. I love my cats. I love myself too. Hold on. I gotta put my password in. Three. Jesus, help me. But I, listen, ask me any questions you guys have. Questions about TikTok, questions about business, questions about funnels. Keep asking. We're, I'm here. Like, y'all just, I don't want y'all to just be here, listen to me talk about whatever it is you want me to talk about. I want, like, you're here. It's 1,070 people here on TikTok. It's a bunch, every, listen, whatever your question is, ask it. All right, let me show you my cats. 
Oh. I got to keep putting my password in. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. That's all me. All right. So that's Eddie. Eddie is, um, how old is Eddie? Eddie's 14. That's my, he, he talks so much. That's Eddie. And then that's Faith. Faith is six. She is my jealous girl. She's just everywhere. She just jumps. And then, let me see. Oh, I messed up. Sorry. So then that's Maui. Maui is eight. She's just really sweet. She's allergic to everything. And she always costs me a million dollars. And Maui's about to get an influencer account because the way the, the bills for Maui ain't nobody. I'm like, who are you? Anyway. How long is the webinar? Good question. So the webinar is one hour, okay? So the webinar is going to go from 4 to 5 Pacific or 7 to 8 Eastern, okay? So it's one hour. Is the Zoom call step-by-step -step instructions? Yes. So I'm going to be teaching. Hold on. Let's see. I'm going to be teaching, and you're also going to be seeing my screen, right? So I'm going to be teaching, and you're also going to be seeing my screen. And listen. The way that I teach is the same way I've been teaching today. I'm not somebody who gives you things where you're just like, what is going on? Mm -mm. I don't talk in that language. I don't even know the language. I just don't. I talk in very A, B, C language. A, B, C language. And I have a lady on our team. She's like a contractor who can build all this stuff. So if you listen to me, you watch the webinar and say, okay, I want to have somebody help me with this, this. I can refer you to her. Listen, listen. We have paid her and taught her all of this stuff. And so you don't have to. It's okay if you don't. But if you end up saying, I want her, she comes with all the years that I have spent with her. All the money I have. In, she comes with all that. Okay? All right. But there's no pressure to use her. Rhonda Clark, welcome to the webinar. I'm just telling you in case you go, okay? All right, let's answer some more questions. Um, hold on. If you run out of content to talk about on live, should you get off live? Yes, yes, yes. So like for me, if I ever run out of stuff, and I'm, I'm ending, but I will always ask for if there's any questions, right? But I don't just stay on live just to stay on live. Will the email set up work with a Podia platform or will I have to sign up for a different email platform? So I don't know Podia at all. Um, I don't know Podia. Um, but here's what I would do. I would do a Google search, Podia versus, um, do like Podia versus uh, ClickFunnels or something like that. Um, but again, I don't know anything about Podia. I actually have never even heard of Podia. So my answer is, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Um, will VIP be a little afterwards if we need it? Yes, Annette. Uh, I'm so sorry. I don't know anything about Podia. All right. I'm in women's ministry. You're in uh, Melly. So the webinar is on Tuesday of next week. Tuesday of next week at 4 o'clock Pacific, 7 o'clock Eastern. I'm a professional and I'm nervous to start posting. How to overcome nervousness. Okay. So first things first. Why are you nervous? Okay. Let's see. Lena Love, welcome to the webinar, girl. I know who that is. Hey, girl. Welcome. So first things first, why are you nervous? Tell me that. Uh, let me see. I love your energy. I'm an NYer and I prefer ABC language. Okay. I'm like, when I go places and people be talking over my head, I always be like, okay, wait, wait. Can you like, uh, can you speak that in lamest terms? I'm the person at every event that asks a million questions because I'm like, I don't even know what you're talking about. I don't get it. I don't, I will interrupt if you say it again. Because I'm like, if I can get it, I can get it. If I can't get it, I, you got to stop because I ain't getting it. Um, let me see. How do we sign up for the webinar? So you, to sign up for the webinar, just go to kenyakelly.com slash viral. kenyakelly.com slash viral. Okay. Will there be a recording of reference at a later time? No, there will not. Okay. No, there will not. Okay. Happy Wednesday. <laughs> All right. KenyaKelly.com slash viral. Or you can click the link on my bio. My bio on TikTok, my bio on Instagram, my bio everywhere has the link. But I'm saying it out loud in case you want to type it in your desktop or like laptop. KenyaKelly.com slash viral. Thanks for following. Um, can we sign up tomorrow? Yes. So the webinar is not until next Tuesday. So you have time to sign up, you know, but just, you just don't want to forget. Okay. 
um, because otherwise we don't, we don't have it again. Do you have any trainings on how to go viral? No, well, we teach that inside of our courses to our students, um, but I don't teach that as a business person because for me, I don't teach viral as a strategy. Okay, I teach people how to market themselves and how to capture leads. And in the midst of that, we get viral strategies. But we don't like to make people focus only on going viral because what happens if you don't? You know what I'm saying? Like TikTok changes all the time. Social media changes all the time. And we're like, we don't want people to be banking on going viral. So we that's not my main thing. But we do teach that following in with our courses. Um, I hope that makes sense. So all of y'all that are here on TikTok, there's like 1,176 people on this live stream on TikTok. That's awesome. Make sure all y'all follow me because <laughs> I'm like, I mean, hello. Um, also, <laughs> shameless plug, feel free to keep asking questions. I started a separate TikTok channel, a second one, and it's called The Kenya Kelly Brand. Okay, it's called the Kia Kelly brand on that channel is where I am just me being me talking about dating relationships, my religion, Jesus, you know, fashion, hair, having a good old goofy time, all that. Uh, that is how I'm starting more as an intentional influencer. Uh, like I've made almost almost two hundred thousand dollars as an accidental influencer, as a marketing person. And so I'm like, OK, I continue to make money there, but I want to be extremely intentional with my brand that's not marketing related so I can make even more money as an influencer. So hold on. Oh, so if you want to follow that account, I would love for you to follow it if you're interested in that other side of me content that has nothing to do with business. Uh, and that's called the King and Kelly brand. Okay. That one is called the King and Kelly brand. So if you want to see more about that for me, you can go check me out there. Okay. Uh, let's see. Who is this? Uh, Diva star, Diva star. Welcome to the webinar. Diva Star, welcome to the webinar. Um, how do we go live StreamYard on TikTok? Okay, I wish I could do a screen share. I wish I really could do a screen share, but I can't do it like here. Um, but basically, okay, let me let me remember my steps. So uh, who asked me that? Where is she at? Uh, Brent and Angel, could be him or her. Brent and Angel, so Angela, could be Angela. I see Brent and Angel, that's all I can see. Okay, so you're going to want to write this down. So first thing you have to do is you got to go on your desktop. And then uh, TikTok, and you got to hit go live and just have it the screen set up, right? Um, and then you have to click on the go live button, right? You won't officially be live on TikTok yet, though, but it'll say go live. Then you go to StreamYard and you set up your stream or whatever. And then once you select your destinations, like Facebook, YouTube, or whatever, it'll also say like RFTP key, RTMP key. One of those things. I can't remember exactly what it is, all the little letters. I can't remember, right? But you'll see it. It's like gray with like two little like lines or whatever. Click that. Once you click on that, then it's going to ask you for the server URL. You're going to go on TikTok and you're going to copy the server URL, post it there. StreamYard is going to also ask you for the stream key. You copy that from TikTok. It's all on the same screen. You, like you cannot mess it up. I am not tech savvy and it was so easy for me. You copy from there and you post that on StreamYard, okay? Then once you hit go live on StreamYard, then now you're officially live on TikTok, right? So I have the TikTok screen and the StreamYard screen. So this is why right now I'm live on Facebook, LinkedIn, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, um, Instagram and TikTok, all on one stream on one screen. It's amazing. It's amazing. Um, let's see, more questions. How do we, okay. What some pros and cons of Thrivecart? <laughs> that I can't answer. And the reason I can't answer it is because I'm not super tech savvy. All I do know is that Thrivecar is easier than ClickFunnels, right? Thrivecar has been so easy for our team to implement than it would be to uh, ClickFunnels, right? So I don't have the I don't have the actual detailed answer for you for that. I'm so sorry. But I just know that it's easier than ClickFunnels. ClickFunnels, ClickFunnels was awesome, but it was easier for us to, to implement than um, ClickFunnels. Does StreamYard work on laptops? Oh, no, it works on laptops too. So laptop or desktop. Um, will we get information on what to send in an email? Yes. Yes, you will. Yes. Because the whole point of it all is like not just to know what to do, but like what to talk to people about. 
You know what I mean? Because it's, it's like one thing to have 100,000 people on your email list. And it's another thing to know what to say to them. You know what I mean? Um, a stream yard versus restream. So I've never used restream. So I don't have the answer to that. But what I the way I do everything, I go on YouTube and I would type in stream yard versus restream and somebody has a review. I want to join. Awesome. So if you guys want to join that webinar, it is just go to kenyakelly.com slash viral. Okay? kenyakelly.com slash viral. Guys, it is $10. Thank you so much. Well, how many likes do we have? She said, tap the screen and get 10,000. I don't even know how many likes we have. Because when you, when you are live on desktop, you can't see your likes at all. Um, hey, Karen. Oh, hey, Karen. No, that is. Yeah. Uh, let me see. I can't see the likes. I'm going to see real quick. How many likes we have? Oh, we have 3,000 likes. Okay, yeah. We had, I haven't said tap in a long time. Uh, but that would be awesome. If you guys want to get us to 10,000 likes, that would be great. Okay. Any other questions? Does anybody else have questions? Again, if you guys want to join us on the webinar, um, just go ahead and go to uh, kiakelly.com slash viral. Okay? Why don't you reformat your video for each platform? Why are you in movie box form? Because <laughs> I can't reformat. Like this on tick like when you're going live here, you can just go in horizontal mode. But what you can do is if you are on your if you're on your phone, you can actually turn your phone and then you can click a uh, horizontal mode. I think you missed that when you came in. And so now your video will be in horizontal mode on TikTok if you want to watch me that way. OK. All right. OK. I'm seeing any more questions. OK. Your book is nice in the background. Thanks. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Is StreamYard for multi-platform or also a single platform? You can do a single platform too if you want to, for sure. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm so excited to be with us too. Did you try Open Broadcast Studio? Uh, I don't know what Broadcast Studio is. <laughs> See, that's another one of those things, y'all. I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know all this stuff. Let's see what she's talking about. Let me see. Let me click on. I don't see no broadcast studio here on TikTok. Okay. All right. Let me let you guys go. I got a, I got a whole slew of things I need to do. All right. Okay. So if you guys want, again, if you guys want to join the webinar, again, just go to kingandkelly.com slash viral. kingandkelly.com slash viral. Okay. And then you guys can join. Okay. All right, guys. So I love y'all. I will see you guys on the next one. I'll see a bunch of y'all uh, in the webinar. Okay. All right, guys. I'll chat with you all later. Let me see how to hang up on all this. I'm going to hit in broadcast to see if it ends everybody. Okay. All right, guys. Bye.